My name is Martina Jørs and I'm the Vice President of the Danish Association of Biomedical Laboratory Scientists. It's um, a new idea from a region in Denmark, in Sealand, and it's um, a laboratory bus with a nurse and a biomedical scientist. Um, the bus is equipped with a whole little laboratory and they go to the citizens on request of the local doctor or the emergency department. And then on site, they can go in, draw blood and talk to the patient. And then the BLS go back to the bus, analyzes uh, the blood samples. He or she, the BLS, talks to the nurse about the results and she calls the doctor. I think it's a part of the future because, of course, we have hospitals with big laboratories where we're very specialized. But this is to, it's a smaller size, but it's to go get closer to the citizens and prevent them from going unnecessarily to the hospital. So yes, it's the future of the healthcare and it's a part of the future for the BLSs. 70 to 80 percent of the elderly people to go to the hospital to be hospitalized. They can stay at home, get treated or just not get treated because they're not ill enough and they can stay at home. So that's very good for life quality for these citizens. What is expected from me as a biomedical scientist? The first thing is that you can drive the bus because it's actually the BLS that drives the bus. So they get special training for that. And then it's different because you come at the citizen's home. So you're a guest in the home and that is a, a way of thinking that you have to be getting used to. And then again, you're alone and you are with a new profession, the nurses, and you, you, you get the, to interact with them about the patient's health. Mm -hmm. And that is new for the BLS, actually, yeah. The, the results is uh, transferred to the laboratory system at the hospitals by internet. So this, is, this prevents the patient from getting another blood sample drawn if they go to the hospital because they can rely on the results. It's from analyzed by a biomedical scientist and it will be the correct results every time.